Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Dean. If you're new here, hi, how are you? Hope you guys are having a great day. It is Saturday, so hope you guys are having a fantastic saw today. Um, I hope, I hope this comes out today. If not, it'll come out tomorrow, Sunday. But before we dive into anything, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you can be notified when I pop up on your screen. And I just want to say thank you guys so, 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 so much for being amazing and fantastic. Um... What's another adjective that I can use? Amazing, fantastic, phenomenal, um, incredible, beautiful. It's like I hate being put on the spot because then I can't think. But yeah, those are still great ones for you guys because that's what you guys are. So today we're going to be diving into It's Always Sunny Philadelphia, Season 5, Episode 5. And if you know, you know, this season, well, this show is amazing. I honestly feel like there's not one episode that you can watch and not laugh. Like, I feel like you're always going to laugh. And that's what I love about this show, because in a sense, it's like you could be having a bad day and Charlie's going to make it better. You could be having a bad day and Dee is going to make it better. Like the crew is going to make it better. And if, like I said, if you know, you know, this show is amazing. So join us and watch it and love it because we love it and enjoy it. But without further ado, let's dive in. Saturday on a Saturday. You know what? Why don't you go grab five more? I think I'm going to need some proof that you're actually getting married. What? I'm coming in here and trying on wedding dresses every Saturday for over a year now. Don't get up all over my balls, Lucy. Just go get the dresses. Street. Which street? Spring. What's your fiance's name? Sam. What does he do? S salt. He dives in to the ocean for the sea salt. <laughs> okay, I'm getting the manager. Well, don't get the... <sighs> Brad Fisher from high school. Brad Fisher. <laughs> no way! <laughs> Why did I ever break up with you? you it was because of the acne. Was it because of the yeah. acne? Uh, I don't really remember saying exactly that. It's but... it's fine. We were kids. We were... You're you're getting married. Wow. No. Yeah. Uh, no, I'm not. I'm not. This. Are you single? What's your situation? I'm, I'm engaged. Oh. You meet a no. babe. Nah. Yeah. Come here for a second. I want you to meet a friend of mine. Waitress. Oh my god. Safely down into the box. Dude, you're gonna agitate the bees. Is that your end game here, honey? Yeah, I figure we keep the hive in the basement, we'll always have honey. I think I just saw a wasp. I think that a was wasp? A... Did you see that? Didn't it looked look like, like a wasp, a right? Is this a wasp nest? This is... Hey, do, uh, do wasps make honey? No, wasps do not make honey. In the office, please? Why can't we just talk right here? Yeah. Shit! I just got stung! That was a hornet! This a is a hornet? hornet's nest! Oh, I'm a bad boy. I'm a bad boy. Put some vegetable oil on it. Ew. Oh. Who was that? That's my booty call. We're into some really booty weird call? food fetish. The waitress is getting married. Talk to Artemis. She's my booty okay. call. We Artemis! Look at this. You guys, I cannot believe you're not thinking about Charlie right now. That or she's afraid that Charlie might blow his brains out and then she'd have to do all the Charlie work. How could the waitress get married before me? I'm way hotter than she is. And you know what I just realized? I don't care about anything she's saying. Not but bad. what I do care about is the fact that Charlie might go postal if he finds out about that. Well, maybe we should just find something to distract him until the whole wedding thing blows over. Mm -hmm. In the meantime, I'll try and sabotage the wedding by luring Brad away from her. Uh, let's yeah, watch out for the hornets. Yeah. What is he doing? Uh, what are you doing there, buddy? I'm trying to smoke these hornets to death, so I think I just swallowed one. I cannot, As I tried Charlie. to explain before, you cannot, cannot get honey Charlie. from a hornet's nest. Okay, it's actually a okay, fact. Why it's are you not even bothering? Get... We're going to get you back on the dating scene, bro. What do you yeah. think about that? See, why? I got the com. waitress, guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right. Um, I'll tell you what. Let me pop a quick H on this box. This way we all know it's filled with hornets. First thing we gotta do is what we gotta is take your picture face? for the profile. So, oh, bad buddy, yeah, so I think we're gonna have I to- I am who I am. True. Right, but yeah, let's but do who you let's are minus the like hornets you're not who. Why would you wanna look like Sherlock Holmes? Who are you trying to attract exactly? Not that face. Oh, that felt good. Was that sexy? That's oh. That felt Three, sexy. Oh. Let's take another one? No, nah. no, nah, nah, we'll, nah. we'll find another picture that we can use mm -hmm. and nah. that'll be fine. What about your favorite food? What would that be? Oh, milk steak. I'm not putting milk Just steak. Put steak. Just I'm gonna put, put steak. steak and then Don't put steak, put milk right. steak. What's your favorite hobby? Uh, magnets. Magnets. <laughs> I'm gonna put snowboarding. We'll put snowboarding. I don't know snowboarding, what the heck? What are some of your likes? Uh, ghouls. Like in movies and cartoons? What are uh -huh. ghouls, buddy? Don't read this likes. People's knees. Oh, come on, Bro, dude. Come you on. Be what? You know what? We'll just make it all up. We'll make your knees up if you're gonna be walking around everywhere. Come on. You guys, how are you? All right, calm down. I'll be two seconds. 
was just thinking, since Brad, you were saying how your wedding was gonna be all poor. Small. Small, yep, that's exactly what it was. Any, I think right. we're Mumbo good. Jumbo. I think we're good. You know what, though? I kind of would like to meet some of your friends. It's just because this happened really quickly. Okay. Yeah. So you Is it a yes or a no? Because you're kind of holding up traffic. Look, I, I think it sounds great. Okay, like, perfect, like wonderful. Fun. We've got a deal. See you guys tomorrow night at my place at eight. Quads, it wasn't that bad. The person outside their house. I feel like a Cobb salad. It's amazing. It's like right. one. Mrs. Mack, <laughs> make sure that you talk about how the waitress looks exactly like you when you were young. Uh, and Mrs. Kelly, no remember, more. this man that I'm bringing over, he wants to steal the love of your son's life away. This is, that's, oh, okay, they're here. Is everyone ready? They are. <laughs> Sorry we're late. Somebody took a little convincing. Not in you guys. <laughs> Damn, D. Is there alcohol in this? No, 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 absolutely not. I remember what an embarrassing problem you have with alcohol. Sit. And he's aware. Oh, really? I thought there was like cocaine and heroin. And remember when you were shooting up with the homeless people? So you can still have fun, can't wow, you, Brad? I can. Let's get a beer. Artemis oh, oh, sure. and Frank need to stop. Make the game plan, okay? She's a lawyer. I like that. He's yeah. sweating through his shirt. Dude. I, I know. Listen, you remember your backstory? <laughs> Philanthropist. <laughs> That's what you are, okay? You used to own a small business, but you gave all that up to help others. Now, I'm know. a full on re phil 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 philanthropist. Dude, I can't get it. What, what was that? What was that? Is that cheese? <laughs> Have you eaten cheese? I had a lot of cheese. I had a block oh, of cheese. Okay, okay. A block? block? I was very nervous. I started eating cheese blocks. Yeah? Stick to the game. Oh, Do I look You look great. Okay, question number one. Who broke Brad's heart in high school? Brad's heart in high school, and I feel really bad about it. Oh. Wow, you are very forgettable. So broke Brad's heart in high school. So. You dated D? Mm. Briefly, yeah. How many people in the room have had sex with the bride to be? Over here, guy. Ooh. Okay, you know For what? Rain? That was a that was a really dark time in my life with my brother. They have a sex tape together. This guy no. came along. I used to look waitress. like her. Charlie girl! Oh, oh, oh what the hell? Oh. I'm sorry, hold on, no, no, don't leave. Oh you bitch! Oh my Wanna go get sweaty Artemis in the bathroom? Is loving it. Sure do. Yeah. No, no, it's getting sweaty in my bathroom. Just get out of here. This party sucks. You suck. I need oh, oh my gosh. gosh. You can't borrow salad dressing or condiments or anything. I forgot to tell you. I still love you. Are you kidding me? Oh, Charlie looks like someone threw You're water jacking. on him. Yes, I am. I, I was mm -hmm. running. Okay, see, because you're you're bleeding. Oh, a lot of like hornets in my line of work, and I get stung up like bad all over my face and stuff, and then you know it starts bleeding. I'm a full-on rapist, you know. Um, I'm sorry. Did you say you're a full-on rapist? No. A full, a full, a full, a full <laughs> in. Um, a philanthropist. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. I'm a janitor at a bar. I went crazy in the brain for a second, and yeah. my eyes were all like, uh, I couldn't think straight. How the hell are you gonna explain that? To I'll me? say I met a nice guy in the bathroom, and we traded shirts. Are you listening to yourself? Jesus Christ! A fifty-fifty shot. Yeah, that's a good point. Yes or no scenario. It is a no scenario. What? Go back out there, start asking her questions about herself. Talk to her about being a lawyer. Okay? I can do that. Right? right? Oh, no, I, I got it. I got it. I got it. You good? We'll be good. All right, great. Uh, it took a little while. There was a guy in the bathroom. He wouldn't give me a shirt, and I was fighting. I'm like, give me your shirt, bro. I'm the manager, and Mr. Kelly is one of our preferred customers. I want the milk steak boiled over hard ah. and a side of your finest jelly beans. Kelly, we have your milk boiling just the way you like it back there for <laughs> your steak. You're going to like this. What the hell are you doing? I got this. What is the heck? Charlie, make a move, Maul. No, no, don't. Oh, my God. Whoa. What does make a move mean? It, it doesn't mean doesn't... stab at okay, her breast. Everybody in the back. The game plan. It was going great. Look at the people it, in the back. They don't know shit about chicks. We were supposed heart. to be taking that milk stick to go then. And then Artemis got all bummed out because of something I did with the onions to myself. And now she won't talk to me. Uh, oh, don't worry about Charlie. Charlie's over this. Yeah. Oh, great. For your engagement, man, I, you're lucky. Lucky dude. And Charlie Kelly, right? Yeah, 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 I remember you from high school. Hang on a second, dude. Uh, you're not getting married? I have been getting my revenge. I've been getting engaged to all these chicks who broke up with me in high school because of my acne, and then I dump them right before the wedding. I do it to this chick, Dee Reynolds. Remember her? She was the worst. Why don't you go ahead and have this present anyway? Really? Yeah, yeah, I mean... Well, <laughs> keep it real, man. Okay. Okay. <laughs> right. Oh my God, it has the H on it. That had an H on it. Do you know? Bleh, do you know what that meant? He gave him the box full of hornets. 
Uh, fun fact, I've never seen a hornet. And honestly, I don't think I ever... Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen a hornet, thankfully. Woo, I don't want to see that. But, oh my gosh, just when I thought that D had someone... Just when I thought someone really wanted D. Every time I watch the show, every time it feels like it's too good to be true... Nine times out of ten, it is. Especially dealing with these cast members. Like I said, nine times out of ten, if it's too good to be true, it's a freaking lie. And I should have known because, you know, like I said, dealing with these cast members, I should have known that, no, it's not real. I just feel so bad because, like, I like Waitress Girl, kind of. And then, like, I love D, and I'm just like, I thought, you know, this was D's moment. She was finally going to get love and happiness, and she just got sad and sorrow. Poor waitress girl and D. But, I mean, I don't know how I'm, I don't know how I feel about Artemis and Frank. Um, mm, Artemis, girl, you could be better than a Cobb salad. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, don't be... Don't be the appetizer when you can be the full meal. Hmm. Okay. But let me know what you guys thought about this episode. I loved it. It was funny. I I tell you guys all the time. If you can go through an episode of Sunny and not laugh, there's something wrong with you. I, I, I don't know. There's nothing else I can tell you. There's just, this is just, this is impossible. It's impossible. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. Until next time. Bye, guys.